welcome back to the project awesome so i'm back with my monthly haul gifts and favorites video at ngayon ay for the month of march to kaso medyo late na ako pero better late than never diba so um like last month meron akong mga i-share sa inyo mga bagong products actually medyo madami yung haul and gifts so let's start. Dun muna tayo sa favorites. So ang first favorite product ko for the month of March ay yung EB Advanced BB Flawless Whitening Compact. And this in the shade Matte Oriental. I really love this powder. I love it. I'm almost hit. Ay, nag hit pa na ako. This is for 250 pesos ba? I forgot the exact amount. Basta ganun. And it also comes with a sponge. Ayan. Typical na itsura ng isang compact two-way powder. Parang ganun. I love this kasi ang ganda ng coverage niya. Ang problema lang sa kanya, dalawa lang yung shade niya. Yung isa, um, para more on the beige-ish tone. Ito naman, ito yung may yellow undertone. Kaso, it's a bit tad darker than my skin color. Pero okay lang. Sa mga araw na ayokong mag-foundation, ayokong mag-heavy makeup, ito lang, powder lang ginagamit ko. O kaya concealer and then ito lang powder. Kasi ang ganda ng coverage niya. Full, uh, it's very silky. Tumatagal siya sa face. It lasts for long hours. I really love this powder. Again, this is the EB Advanced BB Flawless Whitening Compact. I'm planning to do a separate um, post about this one. Kung hindi ako makapagawa ng video, siguro sa vlog ko na lang. Next favorite ay itong product ng Maybelline. And this is their Maybelline White Super Fresh Liquid Powder. Ayan, hindi ko akalaing magugustuhan ko itong product na to Kasi hindi talaga ako mahilig sa ayan. Narinig niyo ba yung shaker niya sa loob? Um, hindi kasi ako fan masyado ng mga liquid to powder foundations. Kasi parang usually... Um, iba, yung, iba talaga yung texture nila sa akin. I, I really don't like liquid to powder foundation. Pero to this is exceptional. Kasi, ano, ang ganda niya. And hindi ko kalain na magiging maganda yung coverage niya. Akala ko light lang kasi yung mga na-try ko before na liquid to powder foundation. Alam mo yun yung na-accentuate niya yung dry patches. And then very light lang nung, nung coverage niya. Pero ito, I like it. I'm planning to do a separate video on this para makita niyo kung paano ko siya gamitin and kung gano'ng kaganda yung coverage niya and kung bakit gustong gusto ko siya. Ayun. So, please stay tuned for that. My next favorite is this L'Oreal Infallible um, Pro Spray and Set Makeup Extender Setting Spray. Nakuha ko to on sale and I think I got this for 350 pesos pero originally, this is for 500 pesos. So, para sa isang makeup setting spray na maganda ang quality, mura na to. I have a review on this. If you're interested to see kung gaano kaganda to, kung paano ko siya ginitin, I'm going to put the link of my review dito sa um, L'Oreal Infallible Pro Spray and Set na to. My next favorite is this Maybelline Hyper Sharp Power Black Liquid Eyeliner. Itong bagong eyeliner ng Maybelline. Gamit ko siya ngayon and I really like it kasi um, ang daling niyang gamitin. It has a very thin um, thin brush applicator and very jet black nya talaga. Ayan, nakikita nyo naman sa eyes ko. And it's waterproof, it's smudge proof siya. So, tumatagal sa eyes ko. For someone na merong oily lids na katulad ko, this is really a good eyeliner kasi hindi siya nagtatransfer and hindi rin siya kumakalat sa akin. And then my final favorite for the month of March is this Vanity Planet Ultimate Skin Spa. So, nakuha ko to. Um, ito yung kinuha ko doon kung napanood yung previous vlog ito yung kinuha ko sa may um, post office ayan so ito yung itsura niya Vanity Planet um, Ultimate Skin Spa sorry itumunog yung phone ko it comes with three different brushes ayan may kanya-kanyang gamit yan and I really like it um, kailangan mo ng battery para gumana siya tinanggal ko muna yung battery every time na hindi ko siya gagamitan tinatanggal ko yung battery para maiwasan yung mga naglilik yung battery ganun since lalo na to nababasa siya kasi ginagamit ito sa panghilamos ng face. Ayun. So, may iba-ibang gamit siya. Please stay tuned for my separate video about this and my skincare routine para makita nyo kung ano-anong gamit ng mga to. I like it kasi talagang feeling ko nalilinis niyang maigi yung skin ko and hindi siya harsh sa face. And yeah, I really like it. Ang sarap niyang gamitin sa face. Kaya ito yung hinuli ko para makonek na natin siya dun sa haul and gifts part. Gaya ng sinabi ko, I'm going to do a separate video about this one. Pero kung interesado kayo na makita yung um yung about sa Ultimate Skin Spa and yung ibang products pa ng Vanity Planet, I'm going to put the website of Vanity Planet sa baba or you can simply go to vanityplanet.com. Ayan. So, since nasimulan ko na din naman sa skincare, ituloy ko na rin sa another skincare product. So, this one, ito din yung isa ko pang nakuha kasabay nun dun sa post office, dun sa previous vlog ko. So, this is the Banish Kit. 
Ayan. So, sa loob ng kit, meron kayong mini container or parang Tupperware maliit yan. And then, it also comes with this Vanish Acne Scar. So, this is Vitamin C, E, and Ferulic Acid Serum. And of course, yung actual product. So, this is called the um, Vanish Roller. Okay, so, ito yung Vanish Roller. Ayan yung kanyang um, container. And then, it looks like this. Small roller lang siya. Kasha nga siya sa palad ko eh. Ayan. So, kung makikita nyo, yung mga yan, parang stainless, parang mga stainless small needle sila. Very, very tiny. Natry ko na to twice and actually medyo mahapdi siya sa face. Um, I'm going to do a separate video para mas, you know, mas detailed yung pagpapakita ko sa inyo and pag-explain ko sa inyo para mas makita nyo kung paano ko to gamitin. And then, um, kasama ng Banish Roller Kit, pinadala din nila sa akin yung kanilang pumpkin enzyme mask. Ito naman, gagamitin mo siya um, after mo maghilamos, pwede mo siyang ilagay and then patuyuin mo siya and then tsaka mo siya um, i-rinse off. So, rinse off, ano siya, enzyme mask siya. I really like it and it smells really good. Ayan, pumpkin na pumpkin talaga. Actually, amoy ano nga siya, parang pumpkin spice, parang gano'n. Okay, next in my haul list, skincare products pa rin. So, ito yung favorite soap ever ko. So, this is the Mont Soaps. I have the three variants right here. Ayan, sobrang bango ng soaps na to. So, akala ng iba, akala ko din dati, Monte, yung basa sa kanya, pero it's Mont. Sabi ni Ate Sheena, the owner of this um, Mont Soap. So, this Mont Soaps is actually a luxury perfume soap with intensive whitening solution. Sobrang ganda nito. Itong soap na to, masasabi kong talagang nakatulong na nag-lighten ng skin ko. And ang bango-bango niya, naglilinger all day yung scent niya. Ang ganda ng soap na to. Ang dami nagtatanong sa akin before, kasi natry ko na to, hindi pa siya nare-release. Pinatry sa akin ni Ate Sheena to. And then, tinry ko siya, nakakita agad ako ng results na nag talaga agad yung skin ko. And it's so awesome, kaso nung time na yon hindi ko pa siya ma-share sa mga tao, kasi hindi pa nga siya nare-release. So, parang secret pa lang. So, dun sa mga nag-aabang, yung mga taong nagtanong sa akin kung ano ba yung soap na yon kung bakit mas pumuti ako kung bakit gumanda yung skin ko, nakatulong siya na gumanda rin skin, hindi lang nakakapute, parang naging glowing din yung skin mo and healthy looking yung skin mo. Ito yung soap na yon yung Mont um, Luxury Perfume Soap. Sobrang ganda. Ayun, may three variants nga siya. This is called Timeless. And then this one is called Perky. And then yung favorite ng halos lahat ay yung Delicate because this smells like the D&G Light Blue Perfume. So, itong mga soaps na to, yung scent nila inspired sa mga I amino mean, luxury perfumes gaya ng Chanel, yung D&G Light Blue, ayon. So, if you're interested, I'm going to put the link of Mont sa information box sa baba para maka-order kayo and matry nyo. And this is for only 180 pesos, di ba? Next are another skincare products and this is from my IY Korea family. So, I have another um, tube of their facial wash and aqua moisturizer. This is actually one of my favorite moisturizers and this facial wash I like it kasi pinapagamit ko din to sa mga pamangkin ko. And nagugustuhan nila, mga teenagers sila, pero ang ganda daw sa skin nila. And then I have more sachets of the IY 2-Minute Whitening Miracle Gel. May review po ako na to. Kung hindi nyo pa napapanood, I'm going to put the link sa information box sa baba din para makita nyo kung paano siya gamitin. Kasi it's really helpful para ma-exfoliate yung skin nyo and mas lalong ma-nourish and maging soft and smooth yung skin nyo. Okay, next are lipis from Nature Essentials. First time kong natry yung Nature Essentials, una kong nalaman and nakita ko kay Joyce and kay Say yung Nature Essentials. These are all organic lipis, lipsticks, um, liquid lip creams, and they also have lip and cheek mousse. So first, I have here two shades of the Nature Essentials Lift, Lift and Plum. Tinitignan ko yung box doon. Lift and Plum, Lip and Cheek Mousse. So first shade is called the One Sweet Day. I've tried this already. Ang ganda niya. Parang perfect for everyday. Ayan. Ayan yung coverage niya. And alam mo yung parang parang cupcake. Amoy cupcake siya. And then yung next na lip and cheek mousse is called Loving You. Ayan. So, ito yung One Sweet Day. Ito yung Loving You. And natry ko din sila sa cheeks ko. Ang ganda niya. It's very, what do you call it? It looks very natural kapag na-blend mo. And then next, I have three shades of their Velvet Lip Cream. So, first I have here the shade Crush. And then I also have the shade um, Passion. And then, I have here the shade Romance. Ito yung darkest. So, this is the Velvet Lip Cream in the shade, what do you call this? In the shade Romance. Ayan siya. Then, I also have here the shade Passion. Ayan. Ito po yung Passion. Katabi ng 
Romance. Then the last shade that I have here is called Crush. Ito yung lighter shade na meron ako. Ayan. Ang ganda. Next, I have three shades right here of the Nature Essentials Organic um, Hydrating Matte Lipsticks. So, I have here the shade Lovely Julia. Hindi ko muna sila isa swatch kasi I'm going to do a separate video about this one and hindi ko pa sila napipicturan. Ayan. This is called Lovely Julia. And then the next shade that I have here is called Sassy Mick. Sassy Mick. Oh, wow. I like this one. It's more in the darker tone. And then the final shade that I have here is called Classy Lean. Classy Lean. Wow. I like the shade. Oh, excited na ako. Next are products from Cosmetics Unlimited. So, nakita ko na tong mga matte and detail lipis na to. Nakita ko na to sa mga other YouTubers. Kay Miss Chris Lumagi, kay Miss Mayan. Nakita ko tong mga matte and detail liquid lipsticks na to. That's why I'm really um, happy nung natanggap ko to from Cosmetics Unlimited. Thank you so much po. And I even have their Make Brow. So, simulan natin dito sa Make Brow. So, this there eyebrow palette. This is actually one of their newest products. This is called the Detail Make Brow. You can use this for your eyes and for your brows. So, yun ang maganda sa kanila. This is the Light to Dark palette. Ewan ko kung may iba pang palette nito, but this is Light to Dark. I am so excited to try this one. I haven't opened it yet as you can see. And then, next, I have six shades of their famous matte in detail liquid lipsticks. Ayan, bongga! Please stay tuned for my separate video about this matte in detail liquid lipsticks. Hindi pwedeng hindi ko to gagawa ng swatch kasi ang ganda nila and I really like it. Next products are cosmetics or makeups that I bought sa SM North Edsa lang. So first, ay itong dalawang to. So nakita nyo na kanina itong L'Oreal Infallible Pro Spray and Set. Yung kasabay ng L'Oreal Infallible Pro Spray and Set na to na binili ko ay yung L'Oreal Matte Magic All-in-One. Itong powder na to, hindi ko pa ito na-try pero Nakita ko na to sa mga other YouTube beauty gurus and beauty bloggers. And sabi nila, maganda daw to. So, we'll see. Hindi ko pa siya natatry actually. This is actually a translucent powder daw. It's called the Matte Transforming Powder. So, nakasale din siya nung binili ko to. This is originally 400 pesos. Pero nabili ko siya ng 300 pesos. And then, I also bought um, something from Cryolan. Ayan. This is a bit pricey of course. Pero binili ko to for my clients din naman. So, this is their Supra Color Palette. Ayan. Kasi, di ba, yung TV Paint Stick nila ng Cryolan, nakikita nyo naman lagi kong ginagamit yun. And gustong-gusto ko yung TV Paint Stick na yun kasi ang ganda ng coverage niya talaga. So, since ang ganda ng TV Paint Stick, nagpa-plan ako na yun yung lagi kong gagamitin din sa mga clients ko. Pero yung isang TV Paint Stick kasi it costs 1,300 pesos. And then, may nag-suggest si Andrix. Hi, sis! So, sinuggest niya na bilhin na lang daw ako ng palette na to kasi parang eto din yung parang palette version ng TV Paint Stick. Pero nung tinanong ko siya sa Cryolan mismo, mas, uh, mas creamy daw yung consistency nito. Pero halos pareho lang din sila. Actually, na-try ko na din naman na to kasi bumili yung sister ko, si Queen Bee, nung isang shade lang. And ang ganda ng coverage niya. And mas creamy nga siya compared dun sa TV Paint Stick. Mas thick kasi yung consistency ng TV Paint Stick. Ito, mas creamy siya. So, ito yung itsura niya. Para siyang pencil case. Ganyan yung mga itsura ng palettes ng Cryolan. And then, it already comes with six shades. Kaya gustong gusto ka to kasi perfect siya gamitin nga sa mga makeup gigs. Kasi, even though six lang yung shades niya, pero since iba-iba na nga yung shade niya, iba-ibang tone, um, pwede mong i-mix yung mga shade para ma-achieve mo yung shade dun sa ibang clients mo kung wala yung shade nila dito, di ba? And then, ang sabi sa akin nung sales attendant sa Cryolan, ito daw white na to ay white na white talaga as in parang, sabi ko parang pang cloud. Sabi niya, oo daw. Hindi ko pa na-try pero we'll see. Excited na akong gamitin to sa mga clients ko. Now, so, if you want me to do a review about this one, please comment below kung gusto nyo para, you know, magawan ko siya ng video. Okay, next are brushes from Pretty Angel Shop. I forgot kung anong tawag sa set na to pero you can use this for applying your base makeup. This brush has actually remind me of my Beauty Cosmetics Face Perfection Brush and Face Precision Kit. Ito yun yung Face Precision. Ito yung Face Perfection Brush. Pero ito, pag binili mo sa Pretty Angel Shop, magkasama na sila sa isang set. So, magsimula muna tayo dun sa malalaking brushes. Ayan, merong tapered, merong angled flat top, 
And then, meron ding angled brush na parang mas rounded siya. And then, ito yung ginamit ko kanina. This is the flat top brush. And then, of course, we have the rounded brush. So, yun nga, nahahalin tulad ko siya dun sa Beauty Cosmetics Face Perfection Brush. Ang pinagkaiba lang, mas dense yung sa Beauty Cosmetics. For me, okay lang din naman kung hindi masyadong packed yung bristles or masyadong dense yung bristles ng brush na ganito. Kasi, para sa akin na kapag ka masyadong packed yung bristles, um, mas heavy yung coverage nung, nung foundation na gagamitin mo or yung concealer na gagamitin mo. Mas magiging heavy yung coverage niya kapag ka mas dense. And kapag ka mas dense or pagka mas packed yung bristles, um, mas naa-absorb nila yung product sa brush. Ito, parang mas, mas natural yung dating niya and parang mas airbrush yung finishing, flimsy, or mas mas maluwag yung pagkakalagay dun sa bristles. So, dun naman sa maliliit na brushes na version nila, parang maliit na version to, ganun din. Dun, kung i-compare mo siya dun sa Beauty Cosmetics Face Precision Kit, uh, mas dense din yung sa Beauty Cosmetics um, kesa dito, compared dito sa Pretty Angel Shop. But, gaya nga lang sinabi ko kanina, pagka hindi masyadong pack, mas natural and parang mas airbrushed yung finish nung makeup or nung concealer or nung foundation na gagamitin mo. So again, this is from Pretty Angel Shop and this set costs about 750 pesos. Okay, so next in my haul list is actually not makeup related pero these are accessories and first time ko yata mag-feature ng accessories. So these are stainless necklaces from CBJ, uh, no, CJB Fashion Necklace, sorry, CJB Fashion from Instagram. Yung isa gamit ko ngayon, yan, suot ko siya, yung letter B. And then the other one is heart. I'm sure nakikita nyo to sa ibang mga YouTubers din, gaya ni Miss Joyce and ni Miss Say. Ayan, nasuot ko din to sa mga previous videos ko. I really like it kasi very simple lang siya, pero ang ganda niyang accessory, ang ganda niyang accent sa, you know, sa sa get up mo. Very simple, very classy. So, ayun. Again, I got this from CJB Fashion. Thank you so much po. Next are these handle wraps by Oh My Bag PH. Nagpost ako sa Instagram kailan lang nung ginamit ko tong Tylisa handle wrap dun sa um, plain black coach bag ko. Kasi, ang ganda niya. Na, mas napapaganda niya. Mas nagiging stylish yung dating ng bag kapag ka naglalagay ng handle wraps. I never thought na may in love ako sa hand wraps. Ako naman kasi yung babae, hindi masyadong mahilig talaga ako sa mga fashion, sa mga bags. Hindi talaga ako ganun. Si Queen Bee mas mahilig. Mas hilig ko talaga yung makeup. Pero nung nagamit ko na siya, grabe, parang natuwa ko, wow, talagang ang laki lang nung nagagawa kapag ka may hand wraps. Kasi nag-iiba talaga yung dating ng bag and nagiging more stylish nga siya and more fashionable kasi I really like it. Marami pang design yung Oh My Bag PH. Itong isa is Tylisa. Ayan, this is actually one of their best sellers. Nakita ko sa Instagram nila. And then the other one is called Roar. Ito naman ay parang leopard print siya. So, popost ko dito yung picture para makita nyo kung ano yung tura nila sa bag ko. Ayan, di ba? Ang ganda. Again, this is from Oh My Bag PH and you can follow them on Instagram. It's at Oh My Bag feels. So, tumitingin ako sa pagigit ko kung meron pa akong na-miss sa haul ko for the month of March. Pero, I think that's it. So, those are all my haul gifts and favorites video for the month of March. I'm really sorry for the delays. Like always, if you have questions regarding these products that I've just shared with you, lahat ng products na to, lalagay ko lahat ng information sa description box sa baba. And dun sa mga sinabi kong gagawan ko ng separate videos, blog posts, reviews, please stay tuned for that kasi gagawan ko talaga yan. Ang dami lang talaga kasi. So, ano, Please be patient lang po for waiting sa mga ibang products na i-share ko po sa inyo. Ang daming magandang products na gusto kong i-share sa inyo. So, yun nga guys. If you have any other questions, just comment below your questions. Or like always, just send me a message on my Facebook page, Makeup by Being Casio. Or you can even email me at ibsc1989 at yahoo.com. And please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet for more videos like this, makeup tutorials, vlogs, and product reviews. And please don't forget to follow me on my Instagram account. I have two. It's Being Cash Show 89. Lagi kong sinasabi ito sa mga videos ko. I have two Instagram accounts. It's Being Cash Show 89 and Makeup by Being Cash Show for my makeup works. Thank you so much for watching as always. And stay awesome and accomplish your mission. Bye!